Hey guys, so in this video we're going to explore another method of solving systems of equations. Um, if you remember in the previous video we used the inverse matrix technique uh, for solving a system. So that video is in my playlist, you can go and check it out if you're interested in that. Um, so for this video we're going to use the Gaussian technique to get our answer. So in this method MATLAB is pretty much going to use the Gaussian elimination in the background to solve our problem but you don't really need to worry about this um, since our result is always going to be the same. So same procedure as before, we're gonna start by creating two separate matrices from our equation. So we're gonna call all these stuff to the left with our variables in it as matrix A, and we're gonna call all this stuff to our right with our numbers as matrix B, all right? And our goal is to input this into MATLAB first. So we're gonna say, a equals open bracket and then let's start from the top so we have six two and then semicolon to start the to start the second row and then we have seven four close bracket and as i said in the previous video you don't need to put in like your x and y's matlab is going to determine that by itself so you don't need to put any of your variables into your into your matrix in matlab and then we're gonna start by, oh, and there you go. So just to confirm, if you press enter, MATLAB is pretty much gonna run your matrix, and if your numbers are pretty much stacking up, um, just like your equation, then that means you're on, you're on, you're, you're good to go. So uh, for the second part, we're gonna say matrix B is equal to open bracket, and then negative six, semicolon to start the other row, and then we're gonna have eight. And to run this, perfect, we got negative six, and then the second row is gonna be eight. All right, so our equation is looking good. Now to get our answer, all we gotta do is um, put in the first matrix, um, the one with our variables in it, and then you're gonna do a backslash, and then you're gonna do matrix B, and then if you hit enter, boom, there you go, that's your answer. So that's just another method of solving um, a system of equation. Um, if you use the first method, it's it's not really gonna be different. That's just another method. I mean, there are a ton of ways to get your answer in MATLAB, so that's just another way of solving it. All right, so that'll be it for this video. If you, if you liked it, please drop me a like. It's really gonna help out my channel, and then I'll see you guys in the next video.